Good morning, it is day three. We are at sea today, and the weather is a little bit crummy. It's raining right now. Um, it's kind of hard to see, the camera's fogging up a little bit. But um, we're gonna start the day off. I'm gonna go to the gym, Alex is gonna get ready, and then we're gonna meet for breakfast at most likely Enchanted Garden. I believe they have a buffet. So we're gonna go check that out instead of Cabanas, something new. And yeah, we'll see what the day brings. Hopefully the weather clears up a little bit and we'll be able to relax by the pool. But if not, it's still gonna be a good day. There's gonna be plenty to do on board. And it's gonna be fun. So let's get the day going. So Jimmy, who's our cruise director, and that's this guy right here, he is on TV right now, kind of giving everybody the 101 for today. Since they swapped the days out, today's our sea day, it was supposed to be tomorrow, and tomorrow's our Castaway Key day, which was supposed to be today. So Jimmy and Anthony are on the TV, and they are telling us everything we need to know for today about what's going on the ship. Okay, we are going to breakfast this morning in Enchanted Garden. We haven't been in here yet. And shout out to Kelly and Trace, our two friends, who recommended we come here for breakfast this morning. So we're excited to try it. And it's a buffet. That's all you have about it? Yeah. <laughs> it's not assigned seating, so when you come, you just tell them how many you are, they give you a seat, and then it's a buffet. Thank you. As you can kind of see through the porthole, the sun's trying to peek out. But for now, we are going to enjoy our breakfast at the Enchanted Garden. Alright, so we're eating in Enchanted Garden, and today's already off to a good start because we got our man Arville as our waiter, just by chance. Yeah. I asked him if, like, if he knew we were coming here, and he said no, it was just by chance. So we get him twice today. He's the man. I'm gonna miss him the most. When yeah, we leave he's the awesome. Trip. Yeah, he's great. And the breakfast here at Enchanted Garden is a buffet, as you can see by everybody in the line. It's got your pretty standard breakfast items. The line is really long, so I'm not gonna hold it up by filming everything, but you guys get the idea. How's breakfast? What'd you get? I had, um, this is a mushroom and asparagus, like, quiche type thing. Cookie mm -hmm. waffle, biscuit, um, I had a sausage that I ate already. Bacon, I had breakfast potatoes that I ate already. And then I got fresh fruit, watermelon, and pineapple. Nice. Yeah, it's good. So we came up to deck 13, which is an adults only area, and we're just gonna lay out by the pool for a little bit. Um, it's a lot more crowded on the ship today because every, we're at sea, so everybody is on the boat, as opposed to yesterday when we were at Nassau, and a lot of people got off and we stayed on. But the adults only area is nice. It is a lot less noisy over here, and it's perfect. We have some nice relaxing music, and we're going to have this nice view. Looking out into the ocean. Perfect. Oh, it's Captain Robert. Well, I hope you're enjoying your day at sea, and I would like to take the opportunity to share some navigational and meteorological information with you. So we have a very decent weather. Well, enjoy your day at sea, and here's Jimmy, our cruise deck, with an update from Oh, here he from. is. Thank you very much, Captain. I would Jimmy. like to highlight some of those events and activities taking place. So much happening around the ship, so be sure to get out there and enjoy every moment of it. Now at 12.15 in the lobby atrium, it's a big character dance party. Oh. Drawn up some dancing fun with oh. our world-famous Disney characters. Again, check that's that going to kick off at 12.15 in the lobby atrium, decks hmm. 3, 4, or 5. Jack Jack's incredible diaper dash. Yeah. Folks, we're going to be racing babies Let's in the go. lobby atrium. So, have a great day. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks, Jimmy. <laughs> Guys, we are out in the middle of the ocean. There is not a piece of land in sight, which might be scary to some people. I know my mom would be freaking out right now, but this is so nice. Look at it. So peaceful. Come on, sun. Give us some sun. Okay, we're headed to the character dance party at 12.15, but first, we're stopping at Frozone Treats. This is where you can get free ice cream. They have ice cream that's open very, very late. And they have different flavors. They have blueberry and mango, you can do a twist. And on this side is chocolate and vanilla. Look at that. Lactose intolerant, but not on the <laughs> Disney cruise. Oh yeah. The carrots is gonna be coming out any second now. If you are ready to party, say Hashtag Tony from Spain. Look at 
Tony from Spain. Ah, uh, hashtag Tony from Spain. Killing it up there. Check him out. Got the conga line going. It's kind of like a makeshift conga line. Okay, we came to the shops because they're pretty empty right now. We figured this is a good time to come and buy some stuff. We haven't bought anything yet. Checking out some of the pins. We showed you guys these in... Captain's pin. Oh yeah, that's cool. We showed you guys these in, uh, I think our first night's video. But now we're gonna pick them up for ourselves. Remember from yesterday when we showed you the really cool um, butter knife from Animator's Palette? You can buy that in the gift shop. So we're definitely gonna get a picture frame of some sort, but I think we're gonna wait until we know which picture we're gonna buy, because I don't want to buy like a you know frame that it goes landscape if we buy a portrait photo or vice versa. So we're gonna kind of wait, but we'll be back to pick up one of these. So we bought a couple things in the store, which we'll show you in a haul video that we do later on. But now we're heading over to the pub. Uh, it's called Pub Six Eighty Seven. And we're gonna do some Disney trivia. Six, name the song. Mermaid Mini, Typhoon Tessie, Harpoon Hana. There's a theme park trivia too, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna look up. Number nine, we on the ABC that, so. television show Lost, what year did the incident occur? Oh, no idea, never watched Lost. On the Disney Channel show Phineas and Ferb, Ooh, a platypus. what type of animal is Agent P? Platypus, That's right? Perry, Perry the platypus. Animal How do you spell platypus? <laughs> <laughs> that trivia was pretty hard. Yeah. We got 12 and we came in second place. We needed one more point yeah. and we would have won like a cool winter medallion, but yeah. I don't We're know. We're gonna go to the theme park trivia later. Maybe we'll do better at that. Yeah, we'll see. All right, we got the Jack Jack Diaper Dash coming up at 2.30 and we want to watch the babies race. But first, we're gonna go to Cabana's and get some lunch. So it's lunchtime, got a little bit of salad, some rice, grilled chicken, broccoli. Tuna sandwich, trying to keep it somewhat healthy, and then dinner, we go nuts. Matt's is boring, he gets the same thing all the time. So <laughs> <Show> my plate. <laughs> so, <laughs> this braised short ribs are amazing. They like, they like fall right apart, and it melts in your mouth, it's so good. I got some sushi, I forget, this one's a California roll, I forget what the other ones are, but I'm sure they're good. I got some potatoes and french fries. Oh, 
those babies. Oh, oh, it's a race. It's a race. Oh. Those were some fast babies. That was cute. That was cute. And they covered up the uh, Donald Disney Dream statue with all the little Jack Jacks for the diaper dash. All right, so we came back over to the adults only area. I'm gonna lay by the pool a little bit and check out the jacuzzi that overlooks the ocean. that overlooks the ocean right now. Look how nice this view is from here. Love it. And look, the floor of the jacuzzi looks right down to overlooks the edge of the ship. Check it out. We never want to go home. Yeah. We want to stay on the ship forever. Yep, we still got all of today. It's only like 3 o'clock fam, so I got all tomorrow and Friday morning. We are going to try and redeem ourselves at another trivia. Theme park trivia. We should be pretty good at this one though. Yeah, it's probably still going to be hard because we know a lot about Walt Disney World, but it's going to be all the theme parks probably and we don't know yeah. a lot about the other ones, so we'll see. And when we were doing the other trivia, Hashtag Tony from Spain said that he's had people come to the theme park trivia that worked in the theme parks for like 15 or 20 years and they really struggle with some of the questions. So it might be hard, but we're gonna give it a shot. I think we're pretty good in terms of park knowledge, but I guess we'll put that to the test in trivia. Yeah, obviously it's Disney theme park trivia because we don't go to any other theme park trivia. <laughs> <laughs> Am I right? Right. right. Right, I'm right, and now I was right. Number three, the Illustrious Club 33 at Disneyland is an exclusive club in New Orleans Square. What year did this famous Elite Club open? Was it A, 1955, B, 1971, C, 1967, or D, 1989? Thank you so much, everybody, and see you at 7.45. My name is Tony Hashtag, Tony from Spain. So we lost again. The winner has 15. We had 12 for the second time. But we got a strong challenge. Now we're in the district lounge. We're going through. So you think you know your Disney too? We think we know them. Let's find out. Third trivia. Are we going to win this one? All right, my friends, we're going to start with tune number one. Okay, so Alex is the one that's writing all the answers down and clearly has no idea how to spell this with the answers Opal. It's an opera win for you. All right, we got 40 out of 45. I don't think that's good enough to win, but we'll see. I want to. This is probably the best we did so far at all. Um, yeah. Like this was the easiest out of the other ones, for sure. It's like two points this time. We're getting closer. We're gonna win one of these trivia one of these days. It's a bucket hat. I want to Okay, so we just came back to the room. It's about five o'clock. We are gonna get ready for pirate night. So let's change. Arr! It's pirate night on the Disney Dream and we are ready to go. So check out our cool bandanas. They leave these for you in the room. Um, these are free. You don't have to buy these yourselves. And then this is my Pirates of the Caribbean shirt. Caribbean, however you say it. I got this from T Public. And this is Alex's outfit. She got her shirt from Etsy, I believe, right? Yeah, Etsy. Dead men tell no tales. Let's, Let's go meet some characters. Arr. Arr. And they have all the characters dressed up in pirate gear tonight. We're gonna go meet Chippendale as our first one. We just passed a huge line for Jack Sparrow. We're gonna try to catch him later. If not, we met him in the parks um, when we were in Magic Kingdom the other day. But right now we're gonna get in the Chippendale line and go meet them. Chippendale, look at you guys. You look so good. You all ready for pirate night? Awesome. We wish you looked as good as you. I wish, I love your vest and the, the little knot. You too, you look great. That looks awesome. So you can see some people here really go all out for pirate night. They're in full costumes. This is the line to get your professional photos taken. But yeah, everyone's out and about. 
Ready for pirate night. <laughs> Alright, so that was fun. We met Chip and Dale. We met a friend online. He was a really nice guy. Wish I remember what his name was. But if you're watching this, you were really cool. And uh, we also got a couple of those professional photos taken, so that was nice too. We got some time to kill, so we're gonna go over to the D Lounge, which is close. I told you it's district. It's district lounge. How's that sweet taste of defeat? Don't get used to it because you're never right. Okay, so the pirate arts and crafts was not really for us. It was kind of more for like the younger kids, even though it said all ages. They were kind of just like coloring some pirate themed uh, sheets, but we got, again, we have some time, so we're gonna walk around, maybe explore some areas of the ship that we haven't seen yet. Um, we haven't seen the Cove Cafe, which is over by the Adults Only Pool. Might check that out. Um, just kind of walk around a little bit, right? Because we're on vacation. It's a nice laid back atmosphere, and there's no rush to do anything. So, let's just walk around and enjoy it. The shuffleboard champ. Come on, get it past the middle. Oh, we're gonna go left-handed. Left-handed. Okay, it's an eight. Give it a shove. <laughs> I hate this game. They all literally end up in the same spot every time. What am I doing wrong? You know why you're not good at shuffleboard? It's all on the back foot. Yeah, Watch okay. The back foot. Yeah, okay. Watch the foot. Ready? Ready? <laughs> So dumb. Just trying to show off. <laughs> yeah, okay. Fall off the side of the ship. Okay, so we haven't been in the Cove Cafe yet. We heard they have good coffee in here. Oh, so here's Cove Cafe. Very nice. Oh, this is cool. Look, they have all photos of Walt and his family on the on the walls here. I like this one because we're on a ship and he's by a wheel. You get it? I got the salted caramel coconut latte from Cove Cafe. And check it out, they got Captain Marvel logo in the phone. Fun fact, Peter Pan is my favorite Disney movie. Okay, so we haven't been here yet. This is Vanellope's Sweets and Treats. We got all different types of desserts and candies. And now again, anything in Vanellope's is extra. It's not included with the price of your cruise. So anything that you buy in here, whether it be ice cream or any of the candy they have, it is an extra charge, just so you know. Peanut butter Snickers looks like bomb. Okay, okay. okay, so we kind of just were gonna walk through, but then we saw all of these different flavors of gelato, and oh my goodness, they look so good. Again, extra charge, but we haven't really paid for a whole lot on this trip so far, so we might get that. Look at this. They have Captain Crunch gelato, Twix gelato, chocolate covered strawberry, candy explosion, and then of course you got a Mickey gelato, and then this one back here is a mini. You got all different sorts of cupcakes and other treats in here. You got Lightning McQueen, Beauty and the Beast, Red Velvet, Minnie Mouse. If your birthday's in April, they have your birthstone as a cupcake. Wow, that's neat. Or Wreck-It Ralph, because we're, of course we're in Penelope's. And you got all these, which are interesting, different types of candies. That's awesome. I want to come back later and get the gelato. Yeah, I might get the Captain Crunch one. That I looks really I want, good. I want the, well, what did I say? It was the peanut butter Snickers or something? Yeah. Was it, that was what, wasn't that what Tony was talking about before? He was saying peanut butter Snickers. Oh yes, from Penelope's, yeah. Hashtag Tony from Spain <laughs> said that that was his favorite, so yeah. I have to come back and check. That's it. Check out the elevator. We're on our way down. Whoa. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Yeah, wow. I didn't know they had these. We didn't get in one of these yet. Wow. That's... See, we didn't get in one of these Ah, yet. look, and then you could see the lobby atrium on our way down. That was awesome. Yeah. Wow. 
We're up on deck 12 getting ready for Mickey's Pirates in the Caribbean. But are we in the Caribbean? No, I don't think so, right? We're in, we're in the Bahamas. But either way, it's Pirate Night. We're up here on deck 12. We got a pretty good view. And we are ready for some pirate fun. And then I'm hungry. We are eating at Animator's Palette again tonight. I'm assuming it's going to be pirate themed. And we'll show you guys that. But for now, it's time for the stage show. Second night in a row. Well, pirate right. themed tonight. Pirate themed, and Orville said he's bringing his friend named Chicky Chicky. So we're gonna find out what that is. I don't know. But. <laughs> Maybe some more riddles tonight too. Yeah, we gotta get Orville in the video tonight. Yeah. He needs to like be in the vlog. Hey, Ali. Table number one one night, please. Yep. Thank you. Enjoy the one of the Thank you. All right, tonight's our Pirates in the Caribbean dinner at Animator's Palette. Let's open up the menu and see what they have tonight. Even though I had chicken last night, Orville suggested the Tia Dama's jerk chicken. He says it's really good, so I think I'm going to go with that. Alex is going to go with Jack's Treasure of the Seas, which is a pasta dish with all different types of seafood in it. it. Sounds really good. He also said the lamb shank was really good. I've never had lamb, and I'm on the fence about trying it here, but I think I'm going to play it safe and go with the jerk chicken, and I'm hoping that Enchanted Garden tomorrow has a good uh, steak option. So you can see the theming tonight on the screens and animators palette is obviously pirate themed. Got all different pirate sketches around. These have been changing for the past couple first few minutes that we've been here. Really cool. And the bread service tonight is Johnny Cakes, which is basically um, cornbread with like a mango dipping sauce. It's really sweet, interesting combination. I like it, Alex doesn't, but hey. Can't win them all, right? All right, so tonight as an appetizer, I got the vegetable samosa. And this is like stuffed with all different veggies and um, he says spices as well. He says it's really good and kind of a little bit spicy. And Alex got the crab cake. Orville's riddle tonight, what gets bigger, the more you take from it. Do we have any idea? We can't figure it out. I'm gonna ask him for a hint. We need a hint. We need a hint on the, on the, on the riddle. Uh, four letters. Four letters. Starts with an H. A 
hole. A hole? Like if you dig a hole? It's probably a hole. It's gotta be a hole, right? Like if you dig a hole. Alright, anyway, here's our food. Here's my chicken. There's your Jack's. Was it Jack's Treasure of the Seas? Yeah. And Ali's is supposedly coming by. And there he is. But Ali's the man. Thank you so much. Um, sure, a little bit. Thank you. Awesome. I don't even have to peel my shrimps myself. <laughs> they do everything for That's you. That's it. Ali literally peeled all your shrimp. Yep. That's amazing. Yeah. He worked his magic. <laughs> yeah. And here is the dessert menu for tonight. Looks like we got some good options. I might go with that bananas in paradise. You were gonna get that? Yeah. Okay, so then I think I'm gonna go with the rum soaked <clears throat> excuse me, rum soaked chocolate cake instead, so we can get one of each and try. That's their signature dessert and the sugar free. Okay, so Matt just ran to the bathroom, but here's my dessert. I got the bananas in paradise. This is Matt's dessert and he got the rum soaked chocolate cake. Are we about to see Chicky Chicky? <laughs> I'm scared. All right. Call him by his name. Chicky Chicky. Chicky Chicky. One more time. Chicky Chicky. With your left hand, I want you to take the plan. <laughs> Very creepy. <laughs> Just go for the coin? Yes. <laughs> oh my god. So, I didn't see when you were grabbing it. I didn't know it was a little hand. <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> oh my god. That is so scary. That is creepy. <laughs> All right, so we left another great dinner at Animator's Palette. Again, thanks to uh, Arville and Marta. They They're are amazing. amazing. They're just so much fun to be around. And I think they like us the best out of like all the tables they have too. Yeah, like some we, people don't get into no, it, but like we like joke around with them, yeah. they joke around with us, they're yeah. awesome. They're so much fun, and the food was pretty good tonight. Yeah. Um, similar to last night, but I liked it. Uh, my chicken had like a different kind of seasoning on it. Your pasta was pretty good. It was good, yeah. I didn't try any of the seafood, but the pasta itself was good. Mm -hmm. And yeah, and then we got to meet Chicky Chicky, as you oh. guys saw. That was I didn't favorite. like that it scared me so bad. Yeah, that, I didn't know, I don't know how we did that. I don't know either. Yeah, I don't know if I wanted. And then when he guessed our number too, we didn't show that, but he put yeah. cards on the table. He made us um, pick the cards with our favorite number on it, and he guessed it. Right he guessed away. both of our numbers. That's crazy. So he's a server. He's a comedian. He's a magician. <laughs> he man, knows his riddles. The man does it all, and Martin's <laughs> great too. We had a good talk with both of them about yeah. like working on the ship, and we got pictures with them in their in their pirate outfits. We'll insert a picture here. And now um, we're gonna get in line for Captain Hook and Smee. It's probably gonna be a little bit of a wait. We're running late, so we better go. We better go, otherwise we're not gonna meet them. Vanellope's earlier. Now we got, what'd you get? Peanut butter Snickers. I got the Captain Crunch, but we're taking these bad boys back out to the dance floor. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. Dad's Zach leading the way. He's going up. Ah, oh, this is a party now. Look at this. How amazing. Got that conga line going down the stairs. Well, that was so much fun. <laughs> we danced uh, we the night away. Yeah, we danced for about an hour or so. It was a lot of fun. Um, the cast members there were great, obviously. It was just a good time. Yeah. Guys, we're gonna let you in on a secret here. This is where you can come view your photos. You tap your key to the world, and then you can see all your pictures that you took. Okay, we came back to our room, and instead of Ghirardelli chocolates tonight, we got some chocolate coins because it's pirate night. And at first I thought that there wasn't an animal, but he's over here. <laughs> it's a monkey with a bandana on. So cute. And I was wrong. I thought it was going to be an octopus tonight because I've seen that on other people's vlogs. But this is cool. I like the monkey. All right. And that is going to wrap up day number three. And it was a great night. It was pirate night. We had so much fun, as yeah. you guys could tell. <laughs> there was so much to do today, mm -hmm. even though it was a day at sea and the weather wasn't that great. It wasn't bad. It was just wasn't like lay out by the pool and get a tan weather. Mm -hmm. But we still had so much fun. There was like so many activities going on on the uh, on the ship, and it was great. And we're really looking forward to tomorrow because mm -hmm. we are going to Castaway Key Yay. for the first time. That's how Jimmy would say it, our cruise director, mm -hmm. Castaway Key. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, anyway. Um, we're really excited to go there. Obviously, we've never been, and it's going to be brand new and exciting. And Arville said the barbecue is great over at Cookies 2. So we're really looking forward to that. It's just going to be a great day full of sun, full of beach, full of snorkeling. It's going to be great. Yep. So we hope you guys enjoyed tonight's video. We will see you in the morning, bright and early, for Castaway Key.